German Chancellor Olaf Scholz on October 17 called for preventing an escalation in the Middle East and warned Hezbollah and Iran against intervening in the conflict between Israel and Hamas. Scholz's comments came during a meeting with the King of Jordan and shortly before his trip to Israel. Scholz reiterated Germany's absolute support of Israel but called for intensive crisis diplomacy in view of the ongoing fighting between Israel and radical Palestinians and the dramatic supply situation of the people in the Gaza Strip, Scholz and Jordan's King Abdullah warned against making all Palestinians responsible for Hamas actions Abdullah warned, the region is on the brink, urging that civilians on both sides must be protected. Jordan's King did however warn against trying to push Palestinian refugees into Egypt or Jordan, adding that the humanitarian situation must to be dealt with inside Gaza and the West Bank, stressing that a third of Jordan's population is already of Palestinian origin. In unserem Entsetzen über die menschenverachtende Gewalt der Hamas-Gewalttäter ist es wichtig zu differenzieren. Die Palästinenserinnen und Palästinenser sind nicht Hamas. Und die Hamas hat kein Recht für sie zu sprechen. Die palästinensische Bevölkerung Gaza, auch sie ist Opfer der Hamas. Guten Morgen, Ihre Majestät. Im bei der Aufnahme hunderttausender syrischer und palästinensischer Flüchtlinge hat ihr Land in den vergangenen Jahren Großartiges geleistet. Mit dieser schwierigen Aufgabe haben und werden wir sie nicht allein lassen. Deutschland ist zweitgrößter bilateraler Geldgeber für humanitäre Hilfe und in der Entwicklungszusammenarbeit. Ich danke Ihnen für das Engagement des Königsreichs und sage Ihnen unsere weitere Unterstützung fest zu. Thousands of innocent civilians have been lost, uh, Palestinian lives, Israeli lives. These are sons, these are daughters, these are mothers, fathers, husbands and wives. Many more lives are at risk. Hundreds of thousands have no access to food, water, electricity and other basic services. This is unacceptable on all levels, legal and human. And Your Excellency, the whole region is at the brink of falling into the abyss that this new cycle of death and destruction is pushing us towards. The threat of this war expanding is real. The cost this will bring on all of us is too much to bear. All our efforts are needed to make sure we don't get there. And I think I can quite strongly speak on behalf not only of um, 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 uh, Jordan as a nation, but of uh, our friends in Egypt, that is a red line. Uh, because I think that is the plan by certain of the usual suspects to try and create de facto issues on the ground. No refugees in Jordan, no refugees in Egypt. This is a situation of humanitarian dimension that has to be dealt inside of Gaza and, uh, and, and the West Bank and not to try and push the Palestinian challenge and their future onto other people's shoulders. Thank you.